Hey there, it's Mark. Welcome to another Race Screws Case unboxing video. If you tuned in <laughs> back in May, May 8th, I think I unboxed this USA. This, this is a code for USA L2593. You can see it on all of the cases. Those are the USA English cases. And I unboxed J May 8th. And then before 4th of July, I got the L case. Oh, May, June, July. What happened to the K case? It didn't show up until this week, August, whatever this week is. I don't even, I don't even keep track of the date. Uh, anyways, the date is with the uh, video below. Anyways, I'm publishing this the same day I'm going to film this video. Uh, I like to have my cases in order in my playlist. I have a case unboxing playlist. And I like to have that in order, so when the viewer looks at the playlist, it's all in order. J, K, L, except for I got them out of order. Got this first, then this, and then just this week I got this case. Uh, so I've been holding off on this case. I've had it for a month, and I just have been waiting. So now, by the way, it's the same. I just, I just have it turned sideways. Um, in case you're wondering, why does it not look the same? And this one's all open. That's why it's bigger. <laughs> it's, it's not a bigger box. It's just open. I have... That's real quick. Okay, look. New for 2020. These are the three models, new models that were new in the J case, Eric and Stein rod. We're going to see, do they carry over? They should carry over into the K case. They usually do. The brand new models appear two cases in a row. Eric and Stein rod. You have the 98 Honda Prelude and also the uh, Jeep Gladiator. Has a couple motorcycles in the back. Now I expect to see these in the K case. Now, before the J case was not I, they don't they don't use the letters I because it looks like a number one, I guess. And when we get up to the number uh, M N O P, O, there's not going to be an O either, just in case you're a new collector. So the new cases, the new cars that were in the uh, this this came out of the J case. These were carryovers actually. They reissued them in the in the J case. So this was their second appearance. Party wagon. Here you have the Corvette convertible, the 19 Corvette ZR1 convertible, and 91 GMC Cyclone. Uh, I was in Ralph's this week, which is in the which is a division of Kroger, and uh, yeah, picked me up a couple extra Cyclones. Pretty cool looking truck. Hopefully, this was in the J case. It would be nice if it carried over into the K case. We'll find out. And the English packages, you can tell the case right there. So this came out of the J case. And I just want to show this real quick. Uh, this was the basic treasure hunt. They're not in every case. Treasure hunts are not in every case. Basic treasure hunts are more common than super treasure hunts. But basic treasure hunts, you'll be able to find a circle flame logo somewhere on the car like that. And it's behind the car as well, if you can see. Sometimes the car's big and you can't see it. Uh, basic treasure hunt will have a silver logo. Super treasure hunts will have a gold logo. Uh, Super Treasures do not have the uh, Circle Flame logo. Super Treasure Hunts tend to have a TH logo. Um, anyways, so it'd be nice if we have a basic treasure hunt, or it'd be even more nice if we have a Super Treasure Hunt. We'll find out. Super Treasure Hunt in the K case? Well, we'll just wait. By the way, if, you if you're going to post a comment, Track time shout outs no longer exist. I still do track time. I still will be doing track time, but no shout outs due to changes on YouTube. Uh, I just can't, I can't do shout outs no more. I don't know if you're a kid and I can't take your name and put your name in a video if you're a kid. Uh, no offense. Look, man, uh, you know, we're all collectors, but just because of laws, I, I can't put your name in a video, okay? And sure enough, there's the carryover of the 98 Honda Prelude. Looks like it had the same wheels or has the same wheels. Night Dragon. Notice how they have a, a driver riding on Night Dragon. And this was also in the last case. Lamborghini Sesto Elemento. There you go. That's better light right there. Lamborghini Sesto Elemento. That's a carryover for the last case. It's not a new model. It's been around for a long, long time. Yeah, see? Sure enough. There you go. There's your Gladiator carrying over from the nest. This is a new model, but the second case appearance. Humvee. 
Audi RS Coupe, RS5 Coupe, in black. Here you have two samples of the Porsche 911 GT3 RS. Very, very awesome graphics on this. Oh, check out the ghost graphic on the roof. I don't remember if I seen that last time. Do they both have it? I do not remember seeing that ghost graphic on the roof. Uh, so anyways, there you go. That's cool. And there is the prelude again carrying over. Let's see. Scoop in a little bit. I already can see another Lamborghini. Sesto Elemento. Here you have the 68 Shelby GT500. And Vela Chita, Vela Cita, swimming for the uh, Olympic Games. Someone asked me, are these going to be rare and popular uh, in the future? No, look, they're, they're, they're massively produced, just like all the other cars, okay? Just buy what you like. It's not necessarily going to be uh, worth anything in the future. Here you have the custom 56 Ford truck. Another Shelby GT500, 2018 Honda Civic Type R, another car that got a very nice graphic scheme. Four trucks, people like uh, four trucks. Here you have the R cars. The R cars have lots of graphics on them. So this one has a very cool graphic right there. Circle Flame logo. This is the basic treasure hunt in this case. So if you find this, you find the basic treasure hunt. It's not going to be in every case. If you find it, it's going to be in a K-Case mix on the back. There you have the K-Case mix. And like I said, because sometimes because the model's bigger, you can't see the Circle Flame logo. Uh, it's down there somewhere. Here you have another truck, the 49 Ford F1 in orange. You have a Nissan 300ZX twin turbo. And 57 Chevy in Pepto Bismol pink. Nice color. Nice to get extra pink cars for people who like to collect pink cars. Mad props. Bella Chita again in Tokyo Games Olympic Series. 2090 Acura NSX. And what's actually this? Olympic Games Tokyo 2020. I kept saying Olympic. I thought I better check, but better check. And I might be talking about this one on Mr. Grooves. That's my collector channel where I talk about cars. Race Grooves will be returning very quickly to, it'll be changing, 57 Plymouth Fury. It's not going to be changing. It's just that it is going to kind of return to more of its original roots, croc rod. We'll see how that goes, going back to its original roots uh, with the changes on YouTube. I don't know if it's going to be successful or not. I will still be doing the case unboxing videos. 2018 Ford Mustang GT. Here you have a Lamborghini. Centenario Roadster, 16 Lamborghini. Hey, Bat Copter in the singles. Mm, I don't know if this has been in the singles before. I got to be careful because... After collecting for over 20 years, uh, you know, you can't remember every release. But this would be sh this would be in five packs. And so, uh, back copter, not a new model. I don't know if I can see the base color. Uh, anyways, cool to have it in a single if you like that kind of thing. Have we seen any new models yet for this case? BMW Z4M Motorsport. There you have Beat All, two samples of Beat All. Uh, I don't think I've hit the new models yet. 2018 Ford Mustang GT again. And here is HW450F. Pretty good graphics on that as well. And another BMW Z4M Motorsports. 86 Monte Carlo SS. I had the wrong glasses on. I don't have any glasses on. 86 Monte Carlo SS. I had my computer glasses on when I sat down and I had to take them off because it's the wrong one for me to you do for the videos. 
Love this Jaguar XE SV Project 8. It has a, a dark metallic green paint. Uh, I was able to show it really nicely. There we go. I was able to show it really nice in my nice video, last video. Uh, that's a great looking car right there. Let's get to the bottom of this. Get to the bottom of this. There you have the uh, Manga Turner. Turner, like Tina Turner, you know. It's a new model, but it's a second color. There we go, finally a new model for this case. Velocity Racer. And here you have La Fosta. Really like the uh, graphics that they're doing on the La Fosta. Very, very nice. like that a bunch. Oh, blue wheels. Cool. Goes with the uh, blue paint scheme. And while we're looking at the bottom, we can get the base code. And the base code is N09. There you go. N09. It was, this case was produced the ninth week of 2020. By the way, the J case had a code of N05. So J was N05. This one, what did I say? It was 09. Is that what I said? Yeah, look. 09. So that's on schedule. I wonder what that case over there is going to be. It's probably going to be afterwards. So because of COVID, this, this probably got held up. You know, uh, COVID is messing with everything. Distribution, manufacturing. Oh, I'm glad I showed this, actually. You see that, uh, that symbol right there? That is not a Circle Flame logo. That is a track loop symbol. And that means this is probably going to say best for track. So this should be working on the track. If you get international packages, it'll probably say something different. Can't remember because I stopped doing the I stopped doing the international cases. I think in 2017, it was just getting to be too much. So you have Velociraptor and Manga Manga Tuner. I forgot which one it goes, but uh, people are liking collecting this model right here. You know what's interesting about the Velociraptor is they made the dinosaur riding the vehicle, right? It's opposite or it's different than Night Dragon to where Night Dragon is the actual vehicle, right? And then somebody is driving Night Dragon uh, or maybe maybe it's alive. I don't know. It has eyes in the mouth. <laughs> this one has eyes in the mouth. But you get it. There's no there's no driver. It's like uh, Velociraptor is the driver. But uh, anyways, I just thought I would point that out. Next, Electro Silhouette. I think it was in the last case. Two samples of the historic Custom Auto. It was a car Hot Wheels created to look like an original Hot Wheels Redline car from the from you know 68. That's when they started, 68 to 73 era. Grand Cross, this is another new model for the case. First appearance, Grand Cross. Race Team Decorations, it's in the Race Team series. Two samples, and I was also going to point out, oh yeah, Grand Cross, kind of an interesting name. It's, it's almost like there's supposed to be a third word there. Um, Grand Cross. I don't know. It's a little st sticky. I don't know why. It just it seems a little odd to me. And, of course, the classic car, Shelby Cobra 427SC. Shelby Cobra's been around for a long time, decades. Now, it used to have an opening hood. No more opening hood. It used to have a metal base to go along with the metal body. No more. Uh, next. <laughs> Roger Dodger 2.0, talking about original red lines. Roger Dodger was an original red line. And here is a sequel, 2.0. 69 Camaro. Mm, I don't remember if this one had an opening hood before. Convertible. I haven't seen this car, actually. So I think this is the first appearance. Uh, it's not a new model. Uh, it's the first case it's appeared in with this recolor. Range Rover Velar. It was a new model last year, I think. <laughs> Got some uh, taillight decorations, license plate. I just realized I haven't been showing the uh, license plates of the license models, or I should say rear end decorations. Circle Tracker. Now, that's a, th this is a good track car if you like to play with your cars. And Formula E Generation 2 car. Yeah, that's what it said. 
another track car. Big Air, Bel Air. Now, I, I think this is a new model for this case. Uh, but because I've been seeing cars on, on the pegs in the stores, I lose track of what's a new model win. I'm sitting there thinking, I've seen this car already, but I must have seen it on the pegs. Uh, I like it. No glass. It's a uh, big air bell. If you're flying through the air, you don't need, you don't want glass. You don't want that thing busting, and then you got glass all in your face. So uh, very nice. Uh, collectors of all ages are enjoying picking this one up. Oh, you know what I forgot? I forgot to show the back. Big air bell air. You want to pause that? And let me get another one. Remember Grand Cross? It's also new for 2020, first appearance in this case. On the English packages, they put this extra information. So that's why I like to get the USA cases. Velociraptor, new model to this case. There you go. There's a new Audi too. I don't think I passed it yet. There was an Audi, but I'm looking for the Audi Spider. As a matter of fact, I can see a white car right there. That's probably the Audi Spider coming up. Another Velociraptor. What do you think of the wheels? I think the wheels look great on this type of car. And probably for the type of person that's going to like that car. Custom Cadillac Fleetwood. It's a custom car. Another Eric and Stein rod. So it did carry over from the previous case. Hey, there we go. There's white right there. Too tough. In blue. It was a new model fairly recently. I don't remember if it was 2019 or 18. 10 Toyota Tundra, Tokyo 2020. There you go, Olympic Games. So we do have a licensed car coming out in the Tokyo 2020 assortment or a series, segment series. It is the Toyota Tundra, 10 Toyota Tundra. I think there's another one. The, uh, another, uh, as a matter of fact, it was another Toyota. Mm, that low flat car, uh, 2000, uh, I forget the exact name, something 2000. 2019 Audi R8 Spider, brand new model, first appearance in the K case. And there's your front end decorations. HWFF R8, FF, factory fresh. Eh, eh. Mm, it does have a logo on the top right there. You can see it on the hood. And in the back, yep, got taillight decorations as well. Everybody likes bone shakers. Let's go ahead and grab a bone shaker. I think everybody likes bone shakers. I don't know. There you go. Our car's bone shaker. I don't know. I have no idea. In past years, the letters have spelt something out. Uh, I don't keep track of it anymore. After we've been doing it so many years, I forget what each year said. Two samples of the bone shaker. Closed roof version, by the way. Another Audi R8 Spider. Uh, speaking of which, Toyota 2000 GT. There you go, another Olympics car. And because it has graphics on the top, on the side, I'm not expecting taillight decorations. Nope. Rear end decorations? Nope. Nothing there. Here they spent the graphics money on the side and the top. Another manga tuner. Dotson 620. I picked this one up already. I got it in a uh, multi-pack. It was in a uh, nine-pack, as a matter of fact. It's a flat rust type color. But even though it's that color, it's not, uh, it's not weathered. You can't miss that one, can you? <laughs> big old, big old text on that. Unfortunately, it doesn't look like we're going to get a super treasure hunt. We got the basic treasure hunt. Here's a 64 Nova Gasser, Wagon Gasser. Like I told you, they're rare. Okay, super treasure hunts. It'll have special paint. Rubber tires, I have to say that slowly so I get it correctly. And um, the super treasure hunt to this case would have been nice to get. It would have been the 57 Chevy in pink. Spectra Flame pink, 57 Plymouth Fury. Second sample from this case. Nope. 
no pink. Nope. Here you have the 19 Mercedes Benz A Class. Headlight decorations. Tail light decorations. And I didn't show you the 69 Dodge Charger 500. Flames. And you already seen that one. Let's get do these in order. Get them together. Custom 01 Acura Integra GSR. No tail light decorations. Got a lot of graphics all over the place. But not spent it on the front and the rear. And last up, 71 Dodge Charger. So again, sorry, no more shout outs for track time. So when you comment, you can comment like uh, what cars you hope to find, what cars you liked. Hey, I almost forgot. With every case, what I want to start doing at the end is I want to double check the production codes because like this case did not get a super treasure on it. Like I said, they're rare, so it doesn't necessarily mean there was supposed to be one in there. And, you know, I was lucky. I did get a basic treasure hunt. You want to look for a Circle Flame logo somewhere on the car. Uh, they've been using that system since 2013. Now, all of the cars, remember, had base code of NO... I forgot, 9. This one has NO8. It's a little hard to see. I got a light right behind me. NO8. It is not unusual for them to make the treasure hunts first, especially the super treasure hunts. The super treasure hunts will be like, a, it's not unusual for the supers to be like a few weeks earlier. It's like they make them all first. This way, when they randomly put them in the cases, they got the supers made. And it looks like they do the same for basic treasure hunts, but it still has the K code. I checked every single package. All of them were K packages. All of them have K on the back of the card. All of them had N09 or whatever the base code was for this case. And if it's off by one or two, it's okay. But like when it's off by a few and it's a regular car, it's almost like someone put in an old car and took out a new one. Remember, this is the one, if you find this one with special paint, rubber tires, and if you find it like that, that is the Super Treasure Hunt. This is the basic. And uh, don't forget, Mr. Grooves, I'm going to take a look at this model at least. Uh, at least one car I'm going to take a look at, and, and I'll, I'll be doing it on Mr. Grooves. And if you join me on Marble Grooves, you've already seen me reviewing the Gravitrax Marble Run System. I did a head-to-head -head race just like I do on Track Time, if you want to check out that video. And Patreon, you'll be able to see this very soon. Otherwise, it'll be available next weekend. Thanks for watching. Happy collecting. Bye-bye.